So with that said, you know, and we speak about the law of attraction, I see a bunch of these guys and they're pushing that on you and they're saying, hey, you know, you got to put a vision board up or, you know, you have to put all the, I mean, there was a, 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 an amazing film made, um, The Secret. Yep. You said gratitude is one of the keys. First off, is the law of attraction real? Or is, is it just a marketing tool that people use to, you know, get people to make money off? Is it real? And what are some of the other keys? If somebody's watching this right now and they're sitting and they're down on their luck and, you know, they've listened to the majority's interview and understand, yes, I can change my life. It's never too late. It starts in the present. I have to understand there is no present. There is no future. There is, I mean, excuse me, there's no past. There's no future. There's only the present. If I want to unlock the keys to start inviting some of the good into my life, even if my life up to this point has been pretty crappy, what are some of the mm -hmm. other things I can do? You said gratitude, journaling. Are there any other things I can do? Absolutely. First of all, let me answer the question, which is, is the law of attraction real? It's as real as it gets. Why? Mm -hmm. Because again, I'm not going to go into the science because I can teach you and lecture you for a whole year around the science behind that. But I'm going to go back into basic language that every human being can understand. Now, if you, you, if you need any evidence of law of attraction, take two magnets in your hand and play with two magnets. Okay? And yep. then you realize that there are invisible forces that basically either repel you from or you are attracted to okay now anything anything that has is around us has a specific vibrational print okay money has its own vibrational print you know things you want in your life the flowers here on my desk everything has some form of energy attracted to it now your body and your reality it's always in sync in accordance to the psychology you have in that moment and what consists of your psychology? So how do you want to uh, be part of the law of attraction? Law of attraction, the secret, was one of the things that inspired me to start diving even deeper, deeper, to get deeper into those things. But one of the things what uh, I understood very clearly through my science and my spiritual self aligned together, it's the duality of our nature. And if you look at the duality and you master yin and yang, you are in alignment with law of attraction, especially if you have clarity of your values, because your values is like the zeros and ones in the computer that make decisions consistently about any inputs that we put. And then it says, this is true, this is false. So your values filters your reality, everything through your sensory. You're a sensory human being, and you're consistently engaging with your reality around you. And un until you learn your true essence of your how your senses perceive those information how your brain then perceives it because one of the things when uh, through some of the sessions when i go in deeper uh, uh, almost like upgrading people's psychology i'm telling them every function of the brain and how the brain works and then i'm uh, looking at their emotional body and then i teach them heart intelligence then i take them to a spiritual intelligence you some people have come across people who are very spiritually intelligent, but materially poor. That's not, uh, I say to people, if you don't know how to transform spiritual intelligence to material intelligence, you are still poor. If you don't know how to transform material intelligence into spiritual intelligence, you're still poor. When you bring those two together, you really create breakthroughs. And you really are in alignment with law of attraction, not just law of attraction, you have many laws out there. You know, if you go and study the laws of physics, every law of the physics actually apply to us. If we look at the Newton's law, if you look at the law about, uh, like for instance, when I have people deal with loss, I can break people, any people's, I would say, loss in one day, uh, one day session. So they don't have to grieve for the rest of their life. So, you know, I've created all of those processes that transform people's psychology and their reality. And if I apply those laws, let's say law of uh, um, conservation, you know, uh, energy never disappears. It just transforms from one form to another form. So therefore, a true alchemist, you know, my clients call me a true alchemist. True alchemist knows how to change forms. 
So you have an intelligence. In that intelligence, every human being, no matter where you are, no matter what age you are, there's an intelligence that somebody else doesn't have, that somebody else will pay you money for that. You know, with all of my clients, I created unique products in the world. And that is when it comes to truly unlocking the law of attraction. You know, you can't uh, um, um, create something with your existing psychology. That is the biggest failure that people do. Thinking with what you have right now, you'll create something else. No. That's why you are where you are right now. You need a whole new level of psychology, new level of thinking, and new level of way of actually perceiving your reality for you to be in alignment with that which you want to attract in your life. Just same way, if I, if I were to be an arrogant with anybody, they're not going to come to you. I'll give you an example. I was ready to spend a good money with a, with a company who said they're going to automate certain processes in my business. Okay? So they, they reached out to me. I put the time in my diary. They sent me about 10 automated emails to remind me. And they were late on the call and they failed to show up on the call 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, they sent me a message telling me that they had another client. So I, I created a post without exposing them, saying, by doing that, this is what you do. And this is what the problem is in your business. Now you have to pay me for me to sort out your problem in your business. And definitely, I will never recommend you until you sort out those problems, nor I have a zero desire to work. Why? Because they disrespected my time. Time is the only currency we all have that is uh, priceless. And if you start an engagement with somebody who puts you above other people, what they are truly, uh, actually telling you, they value something else than you. And I teach value and I teach hierarchy of values and how if you are, uh, when I go and transform companies or people or relationships, I help them align their values. So they might think they have opposite values, but with a bit of work, I can help them see how those values can align and they can go together. So when people tell me something that I already teach and they have no awareness, that is the true arrogance and living an illusion. That you can have a client because you have automated systems and those clients are going to pay you a lot of money and you'll build a business. No, you'll destroy your reputation. Okay, so a lot of people I see coaches asking me, how do you build a business? I'm in integrity with myself and with the people I serve. I don't have all those sophisticated systems, but I'm building business consistently. Why? Because I approach people from a point of service and value. Yes, for sure, I have a lot of things going on in technology-wise, but technology is not what sells me. You know, I, you know, when people say I'm uncomfortable about selling, I said, you know what? Uh, people who think they're uncomfortable about selling and marketing, they don't have value on themselves of the knowledge they have that they can provide value for somebody else who transforms their life as a result of your knowledge. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.